Outside of the film circuit, the 2014 Abbey Road Cinema Exhibition hosted various debates to reflect on the contemporary issues of Arab countries and the Middle East. This film is, is I think, um, it, it opened up a lot of things. It gave uh, a voice to people who normally don't have a voice. So uh, you, you go in these places that were normally hidden, I mean, that nobody knows about, and there you go inside, you talk to people, you... You, you understand what's going on a little bit and I think it's very important to improve things, to open up these places and not to keep them hidden. So I, I would like to start with the, you know, my impression about uh, what I felt you know, from the reaction of people who attended the screening today. I felt uh, the connection was very, very strong and uh, I felt that the people uh, felt very strongly for the film and they really opened up in the discussion and it was a very uh, powerful and uh, sincere discussion and I think it was I was very touched and I was very happy and uh, I mean I was very thrilled to come to to Sao Paulo Brazil but I never thought that the screening was going to be you know um, so warm I, I think that it says um, as I said uh, there are many many women uh, who are making uh, Egyptian films now. The last two, three years, most of the most interesting films, independent, small budget films, were made by women. And uh, this is very encouraging. Um, and I think they've always been there, but now they dare maybe a little bit more. And uh, they can do it. <laughs> it's my first time in Latin America, yeah. This is, oh, I loved it, I loved it, I loved it. Yesterday I was walking downtown, and I felt that there were so many similarities with Egypt. I mean, it's unbelievable, with Cairo in particular. You know, the downtown of Sao Paulo is, you know, you feel the same vibes that you feel when you walk in downtown Cairo. I mean, I loved it. I loved it. The cinema is truly able, in either a few minutes or in a few hours, to translate many questions with complexity about culture and society, it allows us to learn a lot of things and make an interchange of many ideas. This is what the exhibition does, this is what we have to do, and this is what the Air Brazilian Chamber has also been contributing and collaborating with to make this possible. It is very gratifying for us to be able to show such rich cultures and break stereotypes, break preconceived notions that unfortunately still persist. So, this is the mission of the Institute of Arab Culture and of the other partners involved. Envolvidos.